This sequence comes from Alexander Borodin's opera Prince Igor, specifically the end of Act Two, which is commonly referred to as the Polovetsian Dances. The opera was finished by Rimsky-Korsakov and Glazunov after Borodin died in 1887 and tells the epic Russian tale of Prince Igor's campaign against the invading Kuman Polovetsian tribes in 1185. This piece is a favorite of bass trombonists worldwide because we get to drop the hammer on some low Ds to announce the arrival of the Great Khan. <laughs> Before the hammer dropping, Borodin writes a few beautiful melodies that represent different dances. Strive for a beautiful, silky sound as you sing through this melody. The Russians viewed the Polovetsians as an exotic other, so fill your phrasing with mystery and lust. Maintain a steady, danceable pulse from beginning to end and play the grace notes with the fluidity of a dancing maiden. Happy practicing. <laughs> so much for checking out Borodin's Prince Igor Polovetsian Dances sequence. If you liked it, please take a moment to like it and share it with someone else. If you would like these sequences to be delivered to your inbox each week, sign up for my newsletter at willbakermusic.com slash newsletter. And if you would like full access to all of my resources, all of my sequence, and a secret behind the scenes Get Fluent Music Instagram page, sign up for my Patreon at willbakermusic. Just kidding patreon.com slash willbakermusic. Thanks so much. Happy practicing. <laughs>